Hi, in this video, we're going to show you how to sign a document in Adobe Acrobat Reader, the free version here, and then also how to send it out to have other people sign it. So I downloaded the sample contract here, so just make sure you open it in your uh, Acrobat Reader, not in Edge, if that's what you're normally used to opening your PDFs in. So I'm going to scroll down to the bottom, and this is just a PDF file. There's no signature boxes or editable boxes in there. So what I'm going to do over on the sidebar here, I've got to expand this. If I scroll down, I'm going to look for fill and sign. And then you have a toolbar up here where you could add text or if you want to add like a check mark or a X. Let's say you wanted to you know, put an X there for the people to sign. And then you have the sign yourself option where you could add a signature or initials. And what you do is you type in your name here. And then you could change the style. You could draw it yourself, add an image file, so we'll click apply. You could have it save the signature. And then you just kind of place it where you want it to go here. And then you have that. And so now that's signed by you. And then you just click on next here. And then you could save a read-only copy. Then you could send that out to somebody else so that way they can't modify it because it's read-only. Or you could request some e-signature, so that's what we'll do next. So click on that, click on continue. And then you just add the uh, signers. So let's do uh, OK. And then you could also specify where you want them to sign by clicking on this option here. And then you'll have to sign into your Adobe account, so you'll need this to send it out for e-signatures. Okay, so it'll upload your document. And I'm going to scroll down to the bottom here. And then I'm going to click where I want them to sign. Okay. And I'll just click on send here. Okay, so it says it's been sent. So now we'll go to the email account for the person we sent it to. Okay, so we got this update here. So signature requested on this contract from Todd. So preview and sign, or review and sign, I should say. So agree to their agreement there. So review and sign this document. So you scroll down, or you could just click on Start button. It'll take you right down there. Click to sign. And you could type the signature again. Or you could draw it or add an image, that kind of thing. Apply. And then click to sign. OK, it says you're all set. Then you could download a copy of what you just signed. So now we're going to go to the email address of Todd, who sent it out, and see what happens. Okay, so it says it's been signed by Cindy. So we'll open it up here. Scroll down. So we have Todd's signature and Cindy's signature. If we zoom in there, you can see when it was signed as well. And then we could just you know, print this out or save it, and then we have our double signed document and everything's looking good. So it's pretty simple. So like I said, you'll need a uh, an Adobe account if you want to be able to send out the signatures. And I think you could do two per every 30 days unless you get the pro account. Then you could obviously send out uh, more signatures if that's something you need to do. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.